You'll remember in some of the previous videos we were using the offset command to offset some of the line segments that formed the outline of this gasket plate. Now you can see there it's all one polyline now, but I offset this line here and this line here, and I offset them onto the current layer, which is still offset, you'll notice there in the layers panel, and I was offsetting them by a distance of 20 units. Now the type of units we're using is negligible. I'm purely showing you how to offset this particular gasket plate. Now, if I offset a polyline, what happens? Does it offset everything and tidy up all the corners for me as I go? Well, yes, it does. Again, another little tool that allows you to work that little bit smarter, that little bit faster in AutoCAD. So make sure your layer is set to offset in the layer pull down there. We're still in the Home tab on the ribbon. We're going to go to the Offset command and come into the drawing area. We're then going to right click and select Layer and make sure it is set to Current so that it offsets onto that red offset layer. We need an offset distance of 20, like so, and we just press Enter. Then we've got to select the object we want to offset. So I'm going to click on the polyline, like so, and then as I move outward, can you see the preview? Inward, outward. Do I want to offset inward or outward? I love this preview tool that you get now with the offset command in the later versions of AutoCAD because it shows you which side you need to click on. I'm going outwards. I can take that crosshair as far as I like. I can go right over here. It won't go any further than the offset distance I've specified of 20. So I'm going to specify a point out here on the side to offset, click, and then press Enter to close the offset command. How neat is that? Now, the lovely thing about it is I could undo this and show you a really clever trick. I want this gasket to be bigger and I want it on the offset layer. So let's just undo that offset for a moment and let's go back to the offset command again. Right click, layer, make sure that we've got current set. I'm then going to right click again and select erase. Erase source object after offsetting. In this case, yes. So what I've said to AutoCAD now is after I've selected the blue polyline, and I've offset the distance, erase it, leaving only the red offset layer polyline behind. So the offset distance again will be 20, press enter. I select the object to offset like so, click on it. And as I move out this time, I've still got the preview. I wanna go outside. So I click, press enter to finish, and I've now got my new gasket outline. Can you see that? I've lost the blue one, and that's only because it's a polyline. If I'd left that as lines, it would have been much, much more complicated to do. But because I converted the outline to a polyline and then offset it by 20, it did the whole outline for me quickly, easily, effectively. Working smarter, working faster in AutoCAD.